Hello LEGO fans, Jar of Bricks here with another little mock. This is uh, my second apartment block and as you can see I wanted to get it looking like a, a modern building. So um, something like this in Liverpool when I was actually going to the LEGO shop there was a building with all sorts of different shades of pastel blues and greens so I thought that would look pretty good in my city. And I've just put the medium nougat at the bottom. And then it just goes round like so. Let me show you the insides. So like I did with my first apartment block, I've left it empty in the back. So you can see what's going on. Uh, so I've made um, little post boxes for the four apartments Ooh, excuse me and a bit of a notice board and then just uh, looks like a pick a brick wall but it's actually supposed to be some kind of art deco thing and then they come out of this imaginary door and got the lift to the next Fox apartment and here I've just got um, a washing machine a few um, kitchen appliances a shelf bed there bedside cabinet and the couch and the TV stand and a little flower there by the door now each each apartment um, is similar to the first so things are slightly set out differently and moving up to the next one TV's in that corner this time. And then move up to the last one. And it's back in that side. And I've just put different things on each shelf as well. And that's it. That's the apartment block on the inside. Now I'm going to go and put it in the city in its location and then I'll show you uh, the roof. So this is where it's going to be positioned next to the first apartment block and stud labs. So this is the uh, tower district. So you just got a bit taller buildings and uh, there's your skyscraper at the back or the roof scraper uh, nearly finished. I've ordered enough parts for that. Um, Bricklink will be delivering them in the next few days and I can get that finished, but back to this apartment block um, did with the tiling around this area as well with the fountain from the assembly square in the middle and then just use some of those tan tiles just to go all directions to the various tower blocks let me just go around the back so I didn't get this um, tiled over here because I was running low on um, the trans blue trans blue sorry I'm just used to saying that with ordering trans blue bricks for this um, dark bluish grey tiles I was running low so I decided not to do the back for now and these are the backs doesn't look as uh, impressive you can just see all the apartments but I don't mind saves a ton of bricks doing it that way and I get to see the insides on most of my buildings I don't ever get to see the insides once it's all sealed up and then from this side you just got the air cons on the outside I might actually redo this stud labs leaving one wall open just so I can see what's going on but that's a project for the future possibly just bang my head on the roof and then so like I said the roof of the main building so I've got a bit of um, AC or something and then um, a what are they called um, solar panel for the building similar to the one I've got here and then just a bit of uh, greenery 
someone who lives in these flats likes to grow some plants so that's what he's done let me just show you from the other side of the city okay so here it is from the other side stud labs doesn't look as impressive from this angle but i really like those two buildings i think it makes the whole cityscape look a little bit more impressive so tell me what you think these um two buildings i hadn't actually planned on making them they were just kind of uh, an inspirational moment uh, the first one was when i went to the lego shop and came back with those dark green and i uh, got the um the, the, um, the tan uh, profile brick one on the ground floor and a little bit on the front and the tan tiles at the sides and decided to start to make that and then this current one that i'm talking about today that was um a another um trip to the lego shop the dark blue gray sorry not gray dark blue um, and the um, white flats i got some windows and i had loads of that turquoise color from the um creator expert uh, bookshop the house next door so i thought let's see how many different shades of blue i can get together to do it and then voila there it is just kind of appeared so really pleased with the way it's all looking tell me what you think and i will come back when i've got something else to build show you that i've built goodbye <laughs>